It was basically just a juxtaposition of uh, uh, this gal doing some extreme skiing by day and then uh, two-stepping at a, you know, a, a rodeo club uh, at night and doing both really well. Um, and there was a couple, there was uh, like two or three really kind of fun sort of rock, uh, sort of pop country songs, rock country songs. Uh, and you know, it was, that was pretty much it. Um, and uh, they seemed to be having fun and and it was nice sort of self-contained piece um and uh they may even have been trying to uh i think their sponsor was this tin cup whiskey or tin horn whiskey i can't remember which uh but it all kind of came together and I, it, it it definitely seemed like they were all on the same page and it was a fun little piece didn't overstay its welcome the well program done. was a great watch i really enjoyed following along with these different scenes um both the dancing and the skiing I have no skill in either of these things, um, but I thought she was really talented and it was just so fun to watch. Um, I really liked how it cut between the two different environments with the music bridging the gap between both. It was smartly done and I liked how these songs fit both of these activities so well, which is really great because without the music it kind of would have been very disjointed. Um, I also thought we got some great cinematography here and visually just some really wonderful shots. And this was just, it was great. I really enjoyed this film. I, at first, you know, I was really confused as to what was going on with the cutting, intercutting with the dancing and the skiing and like if there was going to be a story. Um, so I was confused, but I think that was really just because I hadn't ever seen anything like this before, which I think it's a good thing. And it, it was cool to experience this new kind of film and even though they're kind of very different sequences or, or things, you know, skiing and, and dancing, I thought they both were shot really well and really well done. Um, so, yeah, I really enjoyed it. And it was really cool seeing this kind of new kind of and film. I thought uh, this one was different for uh, what is essentially a country music video. Um, I just like the juxtaposition of the sort of typical... Uh, country bar scene kind of uh, um, atmosphere, which was shot really well, with some great cinematography um, against the uh, the outdoor, big outdoor, cold, snowy skiing scene. Um, you don't often see those two uh, put together, so I thought it was really creative that way. All in all, done well. The song, of course, as with all music, was subjective, but uh, yeah, all in all, just a decent one worth checking out. Well, that was a interesting uh, little film. I'm not sure. Um, what all the cowboy stuff was, but I uh, I enjoyed the uh, the um, the skiing shots. Uh, those are really uh, cool uh, uh, places to go uh, skiing. That deep powder, well, that looked like so much fun. Um, yeah, and the um, the filming of those was uh, well done. Uh, very well executed the dancing um yeah it was uh it, i guess it was the the contrast or the um, the freedom of dancing and the freedom of skiing um i didn't quite get the uh rapport between the two i don't think i quite followed that character but um i enjoyed the uh the filming and uh the uh adventure of it um yeah it was good it's a really great music video with really stunning footage and i quite liked the way the editing goes from the sort of insight dancing kind of the human emotion side to the more um, fast-paced uh, action shots or adventure shots of going down um, a hill and skiing at a really fast speed. I really liked that combination and just having the music go throughout. I thought it captured a really great range of emotions visually. A very interesting watch. Uh, it, it felt like a combination of a music video combined with a sports montage, which kind of it kind of felt like a profile of that main girl where you learn a lot about her in a sense of, you know, she likes to go 
out and party, she likes country, but at the same time she also likes to, um, she likes to ski. And so we learn about both of these parts of her life through this without even a single word being said. Um, that being said, I also want to address, uh, I really enjoyed the cinematography and I really enjoyed uh, the lighting. It was very vibrant. Um, all the colors popped out and thoroughly enjoyed myself watching I this. I thought that it was so well done. It, the cinematography was incredible. I really appreciated the, the slow-mo shots, the, the close-ups of feet and the, the skirt, the fringe on the skirt flowing as she twists and turns. Um, I thought it really did a good job of like immersing us into this this ambiance of the bar and the dancing. And then of course, you know, we see the back and forth shots, which was I thought integrated really well of her on the dance floor and then her on the slopes, um, which I thought was a cool juxtaposition showing kind of like the feminine side, but also the more masculine side. Um, and we get both. Um, I thought the choreography was fantastic. Um, just so great from beginning to end. I absolutely love this. And then also shout out to the music. I thought that, you know, they had a few different songs and I thought that they all flowed into one another really well, um, to, to complete this film. So great job. Wonderful. Um, I love that they were able to incorporate both like country bar and dancing with, um, being on the slopes. So cool.